What? No, no, no. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. That's not supposed to be that easy. Maybe I could just hold out hope that it's a Christmas miracle. Nope, nope. What's up, guys, and welcome back to Battle Cats. And for today's episode, I'm gonna be starting out with a loadout full of cats that I haven't used before. Because I've realized over the past few episodes that I've been a little bit too reliant on the same cats. I keep using them over and over, and it makes it a lot easier for me to succeed, but I know that's not the fun of Battle Cats. There are so many crazy units that we've been unlocking, so I've gone back, I've leveled up some of them to their true forms, and today we're gonna try them out in some Christmas levels. I think there are two Christmas levels going on right now. We have Jingle Cat Bell, as well as Jolly Saint Nick. Now, I don't know when this happened, but at some point during the year, clearly Jingle Bell Cat was offered. Because this is my first Battle Cat's Christmas, but I've beaten all of these stages before. It probably happened in the middle of the year, and I thought, I'm never gonna be playing Battle Cats a year from now, so why bother saving it? So I got all the way up to Happy Merry Christmas. Happy Merry Christmas. It's a Japanese game, okay, don't hold it against them. But I never did unlock the special cat from these stages, so we can do that. But first, I think I'm gonna start out with Jolly Saint Nick, because I haven't done any of these stages yet. And I should probably mention, I always get people telling me, you know, these cats are crap. Even if I unlock them, I'm never gonna use them, they aren't good, so why do I bother? Why not continue with Into the Future or Cats of the Cosmos? But I don't think that's really the point. You know, Battle Cats... It's a lot like Pokemon. You're gonna have your starting seven, and then you're gonna have all the other ones that you want to collect. You know, the goal isn't to just have the best, it's to kind of catch them all. I'm so sorry. My awful true form cats are coming to town. I think I managed to level up three of them because I don't have a whole lot of experience. And uh, I also managed to unlock some levels for Dragon, who is kind of the one I want to try out first. Because now we have... Uh, mini spiky nippled dragon. Holy crap, he's got extra legs and stuff now, too! <laughs> I've heard that he's really good. Dragon has always been really good. Because you can stack them, they have a crazy long range. What about, uh, sports girl? Maiden's true form? Wrestling? I don't even remember the names of them. <laughs> the Titan clone! I like that a lot, too. I, I don't want to send out any others because I want to see Maiden actually punch something. Isn't the cat that I unlock supposed to be at the top of the base? Are they hiding it from me now? Keeping it in a little Christmas package? That's not cool. Okay, well, we got 50,000 experience. I got the speed reward, seriously? 10,000, no, okay. I guess that, that was really quick. Moving on to Reindeer Games, and I'm starting to think I might save Jingle Bell Cat for next week because that'll be a little bit closer towards Christmas, and I want to try to get a couple of Christmassy levels out of Battle Cats? Ooh, this is nice. Look at all the lights. And they still have my cat all packaged up. Maybe my cat is the package. I never actually thought about that. You know what? Uh, we can stay on theme and I can show them my package. Hello, Mr. Squirrel. Goodbye, Mr. Squirrel. <laughs> it's nothing like going for a walk in the snow and flashing your privates at uh, unsuspecting woodland critters. That's the true meaning of Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> this does not seem particularly fair. I've got an army of them coming, so let's just quick, uh... Whoa, 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 okay, hold on. No, no, no. That's not fair. I thought you guys weren't trying, because I'm sure not trying. <gasps> reindeer games. Why would I not expect to see reindeer? Okay, I think they're strong against red units, though. So we might be okay if that's technically a red unit. I don't know, it's a little white around the corners. But I'm pretty sure we're stunning it. I've seen it frozen once or twice. I'm gonna send out Bahamut anyway. You can never be too careful with these levels. These freaking reindeers just bounce. Okay, now it's dead. My point being, they bounce around a whole lot. They, they don't do a lot of damage, but they just never die. They're the most annoying unit ever. I'm guessing I didn't. 90,000, Sniper Cat, CPU plus one. I, I really got all the speed rewards. I'm not even sending out good cats. Maybe they're just really generous with the time scores because it's Christmas time, right? I'm really curious what Battle Cats is going to be doing for Christmas other than these stages because usually they're pretty generous with that kind of stuff, right? Like with the 30 million event, they gave away a bunch of rare tickets and stuff like that. We're moving on to Whipped Cream. Not really sure how that fits into Christmas, but if I'm going to fight some kind of giant whipped cream monster, that'd be... no more of the same. 
It feels really weird not meat shielding. I'm just sending out these stupid true forms and they one-shot everything. Does Okay, yeah, this one does have a boss, but again, I don't think the reindeer is gonna do a whole lot. Bahamut, I'll, I'll keep you on standby. How about that? Maybe if they send out, maybe they send out a whole bunch more reindeer, then uh, we might be talking, but I still feel like not a whole lot's going on. Fire is it Christmas, Cat Cannon? <laughs> We've decorated it. Um, actually, have we? No, we haven't. Why wouldn't we decorate our base? Do cats not celebrate Christmas? Do cats celebrate? Yeah, you see, do cats celebrate Christmas? Um. So I guess the answer would be they do, but they're kind of forced to. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're rebelling right now and destroying all of Christmas and getting all of the time rewards again. How? Moving on to the Kood Workshop. Are the French elves taking over? Are they striking? I'm incredibly confused. After seeing the crazy, like, 8-bit humanoid units that they added for the crossover event, I don't understand why they don't add more seasonal enemies. You know? Like, they could have little French elves charging at us, or Santa Clauses, or stuff like that. A uh, black dog just doesn't really do it. Oh no! I sent out a unit as if I was trying. I didn't, I didn't mean to do that, that's my bad. No, Kesajizo, stop wrecking everything. Leave some for the stupid cats. There you go, just get kicked back a little bit. Have you got any more reindeer in there? Because I'm guessing all you've got is more reindeer because that's the only Christmassy thing in this game. No, why do I keep doing that? <laughs> my, my instinct is just to start spamming meat shields and sending out units, and I don't want to do that. I just want to be sending out silly true forms and whacking them with dragons and giant muscly sports girls and shovels and... <laughs> I have such a motley crew of true forms getting me through Christmas. It's... it's weird. I think the only thing that I don't like about them is that every unit that we seem to unlock and get the true form of is only good against red units. All of them. And it's really weird because there's just so much anti-red in this game. I would imagine it was the first colored unit that they added, but uh, I just wish they would change it up a little bit because they feel not all that necessary. I have like a hundred anti-red cats by now. Let's take a quick cat capsule break and hope for wall cat, because I only need one more level to evolve him. Come on. Oh, bird. I have so many levels for bird cat. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Look at this. Plus 15. That's like twice as much as any other cat that I have. Okay, and I think I want to do a rare cat capsule. Maybe? What's on offer right now? Ooh, Epic Fest. Increased Uber drop rates. Okay, ooh, there's Christmas gals as well. Ooh, do we go for the best Ubers in the game or the best boobers in the game? We have Santa Koo, Frosty Kai, Holly Coppermine, and Yuletide Nurse. I know that Epic Fest is technically better, but we will get chances at Epic Fest all throughout the year. I feel like if it's gonna be a Christmas episode, we need to go for Christmas girls. Come on, I have, I have three capsules. I would love a Christmas girl. Oh God, it's another one of the stupid good against red units that I hate. Okay, thank you. Go to my storage. Come on, please, please Christmas girl. Oh, I'm my OG, you know what, that's not too bad. I do need to get around to leveling up. You guys have been telling me that he's uh, really useful at weakening stuff, maybe. Not entirely sure, one left. Come on, please, please, please. Come on Santa, don't screw me here Santa. Oh, oh I got so excited there. I saw a big fat cat and I was like, it, it probably has boobs. It does have boobs when you level it up, which we already have because I've had it for a long time. You know what? That was disappointing. I want my Christmas boober and if you're not gonna give it to me, then I'm having a war on Christmas. I'm gonna tear the whole thing down until I get Yuletide Nurse, I guess. Nurse sounds kind of hot. In all reality, I have no idea what they look like, and they're probably not nearly as good as the summertime gals and stuff like that, but I just want them. I'm never gonna get over how derpy these reindeer look when they walk. Just look at their legs. They do look like two men in a reindeer costume. 
And they're just gonna keep getting tossed around. I really like Evolved Dragon. Okay, you're a little bit tougher than I thought. Maybe we will meet Shield. It is like the sixth stage, so probably a good idea to start trying at least a little bit. I'm not sure if I can really put Dragon into my regular loadout, but I need to consider it because right now I have Casagizzo and I have Paris. They're both cheaper and they're both a higher level. So I feel like they might be just slightly better and they all kind of serve the same purpose of being a spammable, stackable, long range damage dealer, but I don't know. I feel like Dragon is really gonna fit in at some point or another. Oh, angels, what? Actually, that's kind of Christmassy. Yeah, all right, we can have some angels coming through. Uh, these cats are just really not getting the job done right now. <laughs> it's gonna keep bouncing them around and pushing them back. That's how it goes. Far as the Christmas got gun in. There we go. We're just gonna keep pushing it back a little bit. Send out more dragons. Yeah, just keep throwing shovels at the reindeer. I'm sure Santa's done that once or twice. Can you guys please get out of the way? You're ruining my speed record. Okay, let's just send out a little bit of everything because this wasn't even a boss. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get Bahamut coming down the line just in case they go and do something like this. <laughs> Sending out a whole bunch of stuff like the Yuletide duck and more angel doggos and Rudolph. <laughs> okay, this wasn't nearly as bad as I had anticipated. I think we're fine. I think we should be able to start touching that base any minute now. Come on, guys. There we go. You don't need to kill the reindeer. It's easier to kill the base. Fire's a Christmas cat cannon. There we go. Just push, push him out of the way. And throw your shovels at the base. I get the feeling Bahamut is going to be the one to deal the final blow. It takes a million years to get here, but when he does, oh yeah, they'll they'll know it. They'll know it. Eh, oh, what did he miss? What do you miss? Snow must be getting in his weird dragony eyes. I never actually thought to look at Bahamut's face before. <laughs> Cat tickets. All right, I'll take it. Quarter million experience. Not bad. And a rare ticket. Oh, that was the last level. What? Oh, I didn't even unlock the cat. Okay, well, I was like, why am I getting all of these dope rewards for the time rewards when I was incredibly slow? But we got uh, more cat food for doing that. We got another rare cat ticket, which means we get another chance at Christmas, gals. Come on, Santa. Actually, you know what, Jesus? I'm looking at you, it's your holiday. Okay, you know what, we're going back to Santa. I'm gonna ask Santa for a level in Wallcat, and Santa is going to deliver. Right? No? Fine? Does this even evolve? My stupid, oh my God, 29, come on. So I was about to go back to Jolly Saint Nick with a treasure radar to unlock the cat that I wanna get, but I'm now noticing that the crazed cow is available. And I wouldn't mind going after a crazed cat today. I feel like that'd be pretty interesting to watch even though it's not incredibly Christmassy. You know what, if I unlock it, I'll put a Christmas hat on him. How about that? We'll just do that for the thumbnail. <laughs> I want more crazed cats. So the crazed cow, how ridiculous is this gonna be? And I did remember to change to a better loadout, so I should be all right. Just don't have like five bajillion health and end up complete bone zoning me. Where is he? Where are you? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's so fast. <laughs> I don't even think I have regular cow. I have giraffe still. Oh, I really like him. He's cool. He's only single target though, right? So I think we should be okay just to stack a bunch of range units. Oh, I should have bought dragon. Why did I bring bird instead of dragon? Dragon would have been so much better here with his range. Yeah, my meat shields are doing a great job holding them off. Why is this actually working? Shouldn't this be way more difficult? What? No, 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 something's wrong. Something's wrong. That's not supposed to be that easy. Maybe I could just hold out hope that it's a Christmas miracle. Nope, 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 it's never that easy. Okay, the, the wave is coming. Bahamut, get ready. Fire is a Christmas cat cannon. Okay, well, if we killed one that easily, we might be able to hold them off, right? We could just meet shield. I, I'm not even at level seven. I'm not very high right now in money earning. Oh crap, please Bahamut, please at least get a shot up. Nuke them, there's so many of them. Ooh, he actually got a whole bunch there. 
We, we, oh, there's even more coming, though. We might be able to do this. We might be able to, yes, we're killing them off in droves. Oh my God, there's so many of them. <laughs> this is unlike any other crazed event I've done. Ah, uh, just need to keep spamming area of effect cats. Come on, did we lose Bahamut? I think we did. We got a big fat Paris stack and we're thinning the herd. Oh, guys, come on, come on, come on. Don't let them through. Hold the line. They gotta stop coming eventually, right? I feel like this is fine. I feel like we're holding them at parity. That's all that really matters because I'm only gonna get stronger from here on out, right? I'm just gonna keep sending out more damage dealers, stacking them up, and firing my Christmas cat cannons. And moving forward because I'm getting stronger. This is like the first time I've actually used a. Was it floating cat? I don't even know. Bird cat's true for me. Yeah, I can't even send out any more cats. Holy crap, did I actually manage to do this on the first try? I can't deploy any more units. I have a huge stack of all of my spammable area of effect cats. So if we could just detonate the base here. Ooh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! All right. Super rare cat crazed cow. Oh, that's awesome. I did have cow cat. That's what evolved into giraffe cat. I completely forgot. It's been that long. I don't have lion cat, right? I don't have the true form yet. Thinks quick, acts quick, and uses his head. Head bangs only to rock and roll. Crazed version grants area attack. Oh. That seems really good because that was the one weakness that it had was that it was always single target. I didn't manage to get the highest time score here, so how about we return with a treasure radar and I'll use my new crazed giraffe to see if it gets things done a little bit quicker. It should, I would imagine that it will because quick is the one thing the giraffe cat has always been good at. So let's just send you out. Holy crap, they're so fast. <laughs> I love it. Oh my God. It's only at a level 11, so it might not be like super overwhelming yet, but I feel like if you could just spam them and send them out and just have them, whoa, hit the base like right away. Yup, I might be able to get this time reward yet because even if they do die, they just, oh right. They replace themselves so quickly that it's incredibly difficult to keep them down. Maybe we can just, ah, uh, that's, that's, this isn't gonna work. I don't think a level 11 crazed cow can beat this level on its own. Fortunately, I've had a backup plan in spamming Paris's, so hopefully we can still get through this in a timely manner. I, just, I love that I can send in reinforcements so quickly. The crazed cats, they're all incredibly quick, which is great, very useful. So please die, 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 die. Come on, Paris, here you go. Oh, we're just hitting the base through those units. That was really weird. Okay, no, 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 just stop bouncing around, you stupid reindeer, I hate you. You're ruining Christmas. Just let me win this level so that I can get my 150,000 experience. Yes, just keep head bobbing, crazy giraffe. You could do it, yeah, there we go. Okay, come on, that's not gonna do it. Oh, oh wait, that, that was my treasure radar. So of course I got it, a gift of cats. Okay, so what is that? Oh yeah, it was the box, a lovely holiday gift from Santa. Can you guess what's inside? <laughs> It's an army of cats with an assault tree. Occasionally freezes angelic enemies. It's the tree is covered in like little Christmassy maces. I love it. But I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Battle Cats, guys. And I am a little bit disappointed that we didn't manage to get a Christmas boober, but hopefully there's gonna be more chances at that. And I gotta say, an unexpected crazed cat is a pretty good holiday reward. So next episode, we will be returning to Cats of the Cosmos or into the future or something like that. I do want to start making progress against the aliens and hopefully ruin their Christmas. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Yeah!